Well, good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday. Now, I know that I have a, quite a few followers, not a lot, but it makes me happy that somebody actually pays attention to what's going on in my very strange life. Um, I've been thinking very seriously about getting my hair cut, 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 um, and do a pixie cut. Now, I'm going to show you what I want. Hold on. That. See that? That's Judy Dench. That's Dame Judy Dench. See that haircut? Well, we don't need you, or I don't care about their cocktail hour either. Sorry about that. That shouldn't have come in. Anyway, that's what I'd like to do. Um, I don't know. I've asked my hairdresser about it. She thinks it would look really, really good. Now, hold on a second. I'm going to... I'm going to stop moving the camera around. Okay, now you're nice and solid. So anyway, that's what I want to do. So that means my hair would be like super, super thin, real little. Um... The other thing is I want to color it. Um, this is gray. Believe it or not, it's gray. It's actually white. And I've now had this since, this color since COVID because I stopped coloring my hair. Being, oh, I'm, I'm embracing my gray. Well, I'm tired of embracing my gray now, especially since I'm getting to be 65 in August. <sighs> and that's really bothering me, by the way. I'm not happy about turning 65, but the alternative excuse me as I burp um we all know what that is so let me thought give me your thoughts if anybody feels like commenting do you think I'd look okay with that haircut um I'm also trying to figure out what color I want at one time I had my hair dyed um colored almost like an auburn and it looked really pretty because I have blue eyes you can't maybe see them because they're probably bloodshot from yesterday but the, the British brown hair makes my eyes look real super blue, like almost like blue. Um, so there's that. So let me know what you think. And I have one bitch for the day. Just one bitch I'm going to share with you. So I'm driving through my community, and our community is our little village that I call it, um, has a lot of feral cats. And they live in the woods, and they live behind people's houses, and they're all over the place. So I'm coming home today from Dunkin' Donuts. Of course I am. I'm coming home from Dunkin' Donuts. And some smart-ass homeowner, back where the woods are, put in a bird feeder next to the woods where the cats hang out. It's only about that high, that high, off the ground. That's a foot, maybe? So... They put the bird feed in there. The birds come to eat the bird food. The cats come and eat the birds. It, that's, that's evil. I, it, I mean, yeah, I'll feed the cats, but don't suffer the birds. Let them catch their damn birds on their own. It's bad enough we don't see bunny rabbits anymore. So, okay. So let me know what y'all think. Have a happy Sunday. I got to go pay bills. Um, love you. Ciao. Bye.